your girls, the Montoya twins. I'm Maya. And I'm Micah. And today, we are going to do another Shein or Shein. Still don't know which one it is. Try on haul for you guys, but this time it's 2021 Spring Edition. Yeah. Yes. I'm actually wearing a top from our last Shein try on haul. Anyways, y'all know the drill. We like to go through it fast. We're gonna give y'all our size, show y'all how it looks on us, and how much we like it from a scale of one to 10. So let's get into it. Should we start with pants or tops? Whatever you want. Let's start with pants. Pants. So being a twin, we don't really talk to each other even though we share pretty much rooms. And we don't discuss what the other is getting. As you guys know, we're getting older. We're trying to find our own style, our own identity. But we have the same taste. We have the same taste. Not in men. Ooh. No, but in clothes, our style is the exact same. So we didn't get just one, but two of the exact same pair of pants. How does it, how do we get both of the same? I don't know. To be fair, my order came in first. I ordered first, so. But I started putting stuff in my cart first. It kept getting deleted. You had these in your cart first? Yes. I knew right away that I wanted to get pants and then I saw these bandana ones and I was like, okay. So these are just brown bandana pants. I was so surprised when these came in because usually like people are scared to order bottoms from Sheen but these are like legit denim. They're flared at the bottom. Not too much though. It's really cute. I feel like a lot of boyfriend jeans and flared pants are in right now and these go great with that trend. What size did you get? Mine don't say. I got everything in a small. This is right there. Oh, small. We got everything in small and these fit us perfect. Our measurements, I don't know like what my hips and stuff are but I'm usually a four regular like in Fashion Nova jeans and these fit me perfect. I'm 5'2", 122 pounds. Pounds. I'm about 122 pounds, 5'3". I got smalls as well and they fit really nice. I'm a 26 in Urban Outfitter jeans if that helps. Actually, they're pretty snug on me now. I'm probably like a 28 in Urban oh, Outfitter I'm a, jeans. I'm a 28 in Urban yeah, Outfitter Yeah, okay, jeans. that makes sense then. On a scale of 1 to 10, I'm gonna give these a solid 10 because... Solid 10. They're perfect fit and they're super cute. Oh, also on the black jeans, it has like this... I don't know, this is like badge. Did you just have this? Oh, I didn't even see The brown that. doesn't have this. Oh, it does. Yeah, the black has this little deal. But for the most part, they're the same bandana material. Next, I got another pair of bandana jeans. I was really pushing the boundaries. Boundary? I was really going out there with this one because the reviews were kind of <laughs> bad on it. And I was so confused on what size to get because everyone was like the same measurements as me in the reviews, but they said that the waist was just way too tight and the bottoms were way baggy. So I was like, I don't mind if they're baggy because they're straight leg pants. It'd rather them be baggy than too small. Too small, right. So I went and got a medium. I think this is the only thing I got a medium in and I should have gotten a small. I should have just stuck to my size because these are way too big on me. But they're just these plain denim, high-waisted pants. You can see how big these are. Look at that. So material Feels really nice though. Mm -hmm. Going towards the ankle, it has these little bandana strips. My God. <laughs> and they're so cute because you can pair this with literally any top. I'm gonna give these a. I really like them, but they don't fit, so I'm gonna give it a six. But out that's of your 10. fault. It's my fault. If they fit, it'd be an eight out of ten. The last pair of jeans I got were some more boyfriend jeans. These are a size small as well. They got some holes, and then they're like not frayed at the bottom, but distressed. Distressed. Is that what it's called? I think. I can't exactly remember. It's been a minute since I've tried these on. But I think they were a little long or too flared at the bottom, but they're very very comfortable So I give these like a 7 out of 10. On to the tops, which I love Shane tops because they're always a hit and never a miss If you get like the ruffled <laughs> ones, like in the last video I have bought a ruffled one, don't get those ones. Those ones aren't the best quality But everything, like all these tops I got, I'm so happy with. Let's start with what I got to match my bandana bottoms I just got some plain long sleeves and the reviews on these were so good. It's always scary ordering white shirts from Sheen because they're usually see-through but all the reviews said this wasn't see-through and it's super thick super stretchy and it's not like that shiny cheap material yeah that's really nice and then I just got it in black to match the uh mm, what did I get the black for <laughs> I could match the white or the black with these ones but yeah I got those plain shirts because the pants are already doing the most 10 out of 10 can't go wrong with basic shirts I literally just got a white tank top. <laughs> it's like a mini wife beater. Pretty thick. Um, I haven't tested if it's see-through or not. Let's see. I'm wearing a black bra and did this. It'll change my rating. Can you see? Um, I can see in person up close. You can't really see it on the camera though. It's pretty thick. I give it like a solid 8 out of 10. I don't know how it fits though because I have broad shoulders. Always read the reviews on the items that you want before you get them. And a lot of girls be lying just to get points. So make sure their measurements seem realistic. Um, the long sleeve topic still I got. <gasps> Did you get this too? I want, <laughs> wait, I wanted that color, but they were sold out. Really? Yes. What the heck? 
Okay, well, me and Micah got the same long sleeves. I got mine in black and purple. This one's gray, but it's like a lilac almost. That's why it I looks like, like it looks like a blue. What size did you get? I was really iffy about the size. I got all my stuff in smalls. Okay, I got this in a small too. It goes up a little bit on the neck. It's not, I wouldn't say it's a turtleneck. It goes a little bit up on the neck and it's just a full long sleeve. I wanna say it's cropped. I think it stops right below the belly button and then it just has a cutout on the chest. And it's not booby at all. Even if you have big bitties, like these look good on y'all. But if you're part of the itty bitty committee, these type of shirts I feel like help accentuate what you have, what you have. Hang on, my feet are done. I know mine too. <laughs> I'm gonna give this a nine out of 10. I'll give it a nine out of 10 as well. I haven't tried it on. I tried it on. I just, I hate how my arms look in tight long sleeves because I'm kind of bulky. In we're that built area. like quarterbacks. Yes. We were sitting on our feet that entire time. So now we're sitting on our booties. That's why the angle's different. Oh my gosh, exposed. I'm in my pajama pants. My mom's washing my jeans. Okay, next I got a little workout set. What? Um, yeah, it looked really cute on all the girls. It came in a crap ton of colors. But I was like, I really want to try out the workout sets because our friend Kiki bought some and they looked really cute on her. So I've never really been a fan of like these super textured leggings, but they're actually really comfortable. It looks like when they wrap the turkeys at Walmart, when you buy the turkey. That's what everyone says too. Thanks, fine. I got these in a size medium. They have the like detailing to outline your little itty bitty booty. And then it comes with a zip up jacket. It looks really dumb, even all the reviews say it looks dumb if you zip it all the way up because the neck is just so fat and squared no that'd be cute just like a sports bra and then put that literally i tried it on and it fits even my big old arms but yeah i did size up in it because i was worried about my arms not fitting in the jacket because it's kind of snug but very very comfy highly recommend i give it a 9 out of 10. i guess i was really feeling the bandanas when i was <laughs> going through sheen and i got this little see-through top super cute mesh you could get away with just wearing a bra under this like a black bra and i think you'd be fine because it's not super see-through, you think? No. It has red bandana on the sleeve. You can scrunch it on the sides. Black, green, yellow. You can really wear this with anything. Super cute. Super cute. Super cute. I would wear this like in a club setting, I feel like. Or like a music festival. Or a music festival. I'm gonna give this a solid 9 out of 10. Oh, it fits me really good too. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what is that? I don't really care for this top. It looked really cute on the model they showed because she had big old bitties. It's like one of those halter tops where it kind of like shows a little bit of side boob, I think. Oh, I have so, those tops. I don't like them. I don't it look good on me because I have no side boob. It's just like this cotton halter top, super simple. It just has little chain links, silver chain links, and then it ties on the side. I think I can make it work. I just... I wish I had boobs. It looks cute. I think you can make it work. Especially with your hair like this. It's a size small. I give it, just because I don't have boobs for it, like a 6 out of 10. Sorry the lighting is changing, guys. The sun is setting. Yes. We're also filming another video this week along with this one that will come out next week. I think that's confusing. Try to do the math for that. The math. <laughs> so we seemed drained. It's that because is why. you'll see the videos you'll see. that we're filming. Yes. Okay. I always find the cutest tops on the chain. Just a little, little flex. But these have been really in like the trending stuff. I can't speak. Me and my <laughs> basically, we are not trendsetters. We're followers and we hop on every bandwagon there is. Facts. But these tops are so cute. They sell bathing suits like this. <laughs> but we're... What? But it's just this black top. They had this in so many colors too, I think, if I can remember. But I just wanted black because I feel like a baddie when I'm in black. So. <laughs> and black makes you look thinner. Really? More slim thick. Hmm. It gives the illusion that you're like smaller. This top runs a little bigger. It fit me just fine, but I mean, I guess it just again matters on your biddies. So I guess it's true to size. I don't know. I got in a small and like I said, it was a little big on me, but it scrunches in the front. And I've seen people tie this in so many ways. They tie it like around this way and stuff, but I like it when it crosses in the front and you make it like a halter almost. It's really cute. 10 out of 10. Next, I just got this simple red top. That's it's not cute. much to say about. I haven't tried this on. I don't think so. I'm, I don't know how it looks with my boobs. <laughs> a lot of booby talk. <laughs> but this is an extra small and it honestly looks a little bit big. No, I think it'll fit you good. No, I think it'll fit me good, but I'm glad I got an extra small. Oh, that's an extra small? Yeah. Oh, yeah. So if you get this, I'd probably say size down. But yeah, the material is really nice. It looks like it holds up well. So I'll give it a 7 out of 10. Another cross little halter top deal I got. This reminds me of like something my mom would wear when we were babies, like in the early, early 2000s. Thousands. I have never seen anyone with a top like this nowadays, so I got it. It looks a mess. 
not on but <laughs> it's just another one of the black tops tube top you could tie this literally any way i think the model had it just like this on her neck but i would definitely cross it and tie it the pretty colors this would be so cute just like on a casual date like the black one i would wear to the club i did actually and this one i just wear out with boyfriend jeans and some forces 10 out of 10. I got another super basic top. <laughs> you have so, so many, many black of those. Tops. Of just a plain zip up. You have so many what? of those. I do not have a top like this. Are you sure? I promise. This is an extra small. So I size down in this as well. I don't like when my shirts come off me. Like I like them fitted on my hoopa. You know what I mean? Keep it warm. Warm. Yep. <laughs> um, so I sized down because in all the reviews it was like coming off the bottom of the girls. That's one thing actually how I said this one fits a little big on me. If you like pull it down, it will stretch a little bit and it kind of flares forward. Yeah. See, I don't like that. So yeah. I sized down. So hopefully my arms don't die in this. But yeah, it has a little bit of a turtleneck. Not much and it's a half zip. I like basic black top. So I'm going to give it a 9 out of 10. Nice. This top my parents really liked. This is again like in the 2000s kind of style. But it's just this little tank top. Top. And I love basic tops like this because it makes me feel cute when I have nothing else to do, you know? Have you ever had a beauty mark right there? Yes. I've never noticed. <laughs> this top came in blue and green. The green was a little like darker and I wasn't feeling the green, so I got the blue. But it's just this tank top, super basic, super cute. I forgot what this pattern thing is called right here. There's a name for with it. It starts with an R, I think. That starts with like a P or an S. Um, 10 out of 10. I recommend. I got a small fit. Perfect. So another trend that's going on is brown. Brown. <laughs> I was going to get that shirt. Really? Mm -hmm. It's a basic long sleeve. I don't it's know cute. how to describe it. It has a little bit of a v-neck going on. It has the, what this is called, um, it has the stitching on the outside. Yeah, it has the, like, stitching going on the outside. It's just white, beige, and dark brown, and I got it in a small, and I feel like it's gonna fit great, so I'll give it an 8 out of 10. Sticking with the outward stitching, I got this black top. You I think, like these kinds of tops. Yes, you I do. I have a lot of these tops. Sometimes they're hard to, like, match with stuff, though. I've been eyeing this top for a really long time. I'm pretty sure they come in more colors. Can't remember. It looks like a black tank top with the white stitching. But then it has the sleeves, super cute. It was a little awkward the way it fits right here where the shoulders meet and stuff. Like the tank top fit really good, but then the shoulder or the sleeves were like a little too big. So for that, I'm gonna give it a seven out of 10, but I love the way this looks. So I also hopped on the corset trend and I honestly just wanted to try them out before I went on like an expensive website and paid a crap ton of money for a good quality corset. So this one, I know every chick on TikTok TikTok has this one. You can't even tell. It's so long. We have no, short it, torsos. We have very short to torsos. <laughs> We have very short torsos, but a lot of girls just tuck it into their jeans. I haven't tried it on with jeans, but it fits me. The only thing I really hate about it is the hardware. I thought that's cute. It makes it look more like fancy. Yeah. You think that looks fancy? I don't, I didn't think uh, so. I guess I could see what you're saying. Cause yeah. like usually they clip from the inside. Yes. And it's like seamless. Yeah. Thing. And there's already a lot going on with this, with the yes. ruffles and the designs. But if you want a good like push up, get you a corset. It just has these little ties and it's like a sweetheart neckline. neckline. And it's really cute. I just don't know if I have the confidence to wear it out. I gave it a 9 out of 10 because it's really pretty. I just don't know if it's my style or if I'd be comfortable wearing it. Shoot, if you don't wear it, I will. <laughs> I got another outward stitching, whatever the heck it's called, shirt. I need to get like khakis to wear with it. But it's just a tank top. This came in multiple different greens. It had like a light green, this green, and then a darker green. And I got it in the, the medium green. It's just camo in dark green. green. Yeah, I don't know what else to say. I don't know which one, which way forward the front and the back i think this is the back front there we go and it comes down at like a angle so and that i feel like that makes your waist look really good yeah it does it makes you look snatched it makes your torso Stitch. look a little longer so i'm gonna give this 10 out of 10 i really like it i just need to get khakis so i don't know if i really care for this color too much this isn't a corset it's a boost was it a bustier bustier i feel like they're the same thing huh? no not really you don't think so but it still has boning right here yeah there's some boning in it oh that's one thing okay so i tried this on if you guys watch this on twitch i was wearing it and i was super uncomfortable i think it was just tied a little bit too tight it fits me good fits my chest good this is a <laughs> small <gasps> we're 32 c's to give you girls some reference and it's padded which is nice but the boning popped out oh no whenever i was sitting in my chair and it hurts so badly it's like a fork oh yeah what the heck i don't know if you guys can see that but it's like a fork 
the boning. So as I was sitting, it was literally stabbing into my love handles and I had to change because it was the most painful experience ever. <laughs> and I was super uncomfortable, but it fits really good. I think, again, I just tied it too tight. But I it's... tied it. I was trying to get you <laughs> but it was really cute. So I'll give it a 7 out of 10. I feel like too that where the boobie holds, it's so short. Like your boobies were almost spilling out. Spilling out. Well, I think it, if we loosened it, it would be better as well. So. Tuck them bad boys in. This last top I was really excited for, but Marissa said it matches my skin tone. It makes me look like I'm naked. No. It's just this little. Everything's a little. It's just this little. <laughs> it ties into the halter top again, and it has like the booby little outlines. But it looks like a tortilla. No. Look at the camera. Like a burnt tortilla. And it fits me really nice. I just need to figure out what I would wear this with because I feel like you can't get away with wearing denim. It's really cute. It fits my chest really good. I'll give it a. I'll give it an eight out of ten just because it makes me look naked. Okay, this is my last top, and yes, it is what you think it is. What? This is lingerie. Oh. It is lingerie. That's where you have to buy it. I saw a TikTok and she's like, if you guys want some cute bustiers, I think that's how you say it, and corsets, look in the laundry section. So I bought this as a top. It did come with some scandy panties, but not wearing those. <laughs> I'm going to be wearing this as a top. It is mesh, but the flowers cover the nips. The nips pretty well but I'm still gonna wear like a nude bra or something under it just because I don't trust it this is a medium so I did size up in it the reviews were all over the place but it looked so pretty on all the girls I think I could have gone away with the small because my boobs don't fill up the cups too much but I feel like if I wear a padded bra they will it came in so many different colors the yellow was so pretty and there was also black with green flowers I couldn't find any corsets you have to look in lingerie they said to just type in mesh underwire and it'll pop up like as in lingerie and then you click on it and it'll show so many of those hmm. Dang it. Super cute. Guess I gotta order again. Oh, did I read it? No. I give it like an 8 out of 10. That was it for our Sheen haul guys. Let us know if y'all want more of these. I think y'all really enjoyed them because we always get questions as to where we get our clothes. Yeah, let us know if you guys want a summer edition and bathing suit one bathing suit because your we girls get our bodies right have been going to the gym you'll see Urgh. some of y'all have been saying that you've already seen changes in our body i honestly have not me neither this week's post notification shout out goes to ash thank you ash for liking this video subscribing to our channel commenting back goes down below find your girls on ig and twitch uh Y'all, please subscribe to our channel because we have some stuff planned for you guys. For you guys. <laughs> We're working on it back here, trying to figure it out. And make sure you guys watch us on Twitch if you guys want to see us in real time and interact with us. Or join our Discord so we can FaceTime and have movie nights and sleepovers. We have yes. a lot of sleepovers with our Discord. <laughs> I fell asleep the other night on accident. I literally woke up the other night and I realized I was still on camera and I was like, for no reason, that was my first instinct. We just go like that, even though everyone is asleep. <laughs> and then I just went back to sleep. And the only way you can get into our Discord is from our Twitch streams. That's the only place we send out the link. Thank you guys so much for watching and let us know which was your favorite piece down below. Also, I get a lot of DMs saying that y'all can't download Twitch or something. It's literally in the app store, like Instagram and stuff. So you can just download it and watch us on y'all's phone. Yes, and it's free. It's free, unless you subscribe. It's free with Amazon Prime. It's free if you have Amazon Prime to be a sub. Yes. But it's free regardless. Like, you don't have, whatever. No, you can follow for free. Subscription. They, they're they not even going to come. Oh, it's okay. It's fine. If you're a sub, though, you get to play games with us. Okay. Okay. But without further ado, adios amigos. And as always, stay beautiful, my loves. Mwah. Yay. Thank you.